We made it to Deep Creek Lake, Maryland, and we've never been able to charge here except for, well, that little guy, a J1772, which doesn't really help anybody on a long trip. But now, because we have the CCS adapter, we can charge this car at that charger. Let's see how it works. I think this gets plugged into that first, so let's make this work first. I think I gotta use my charge point app, so let's pull that up. Okay, charge point is up. The next thing we have to do is find the station that we're at, which we are here by the green turtle. I believe I have to change the preferences. Connectors, we need DC fast combo. Let's see if that save. All right, they came up. I am at the middle one. Available, let's do start charge. Are you sure you want to start charging? Yes, contacting charger. Oh, I might have picked this one. Okay, it says plug in, so we have to move the car. Let's move it over to that one. So we're gonna push this into here, like this. I heard a click, so did I pull up close enough? Not quite. I think we got it there. Is that gonna work? Okay, I think it's plugged in. Oh, it was too late. Start charge, start charging. Contacting charger. Okay, that, we heard a pop there. Okay, it says charging on the screen. Oh, contactor just opened on the Tesla. We are charging. So, that was a lot harder than I thought it would be, but we are starting to charge. Let's go check how fast it's going. And as suspected, this is a 50 kilowatt, I believe. We're going 51 kilowatts. And for me to get back to 80%, it's gonna take 20 minutes, which, hey, not bad. So we'll charge here for a minute and then we'll Look at disconnecting. So the first step is stop charging, and then we're gonna remove the adapter. Let's go out here, and we did, just for information, we did $1.75, 17 miles added. Hit the first buttons, stop charging. All right, that looks good. Looks like it unlocked the charge port already. The next thing we're gonna do is grab a hold, I guess, by the bottom here. Yeah, and it pulls right out, great. And there's my charge port closed, and we press the button. And, yeah, a little bit of wiggling, and it comes right out. So, hang this guy back up in the CC combo, CCS combo spot. This is a nice one because it has this and a Chatamo. So if you had the Chatamo adapter, you could also charge at 50 kilowatts at the same place. So, CCS adapter, success. I'll put the stats right here, here right here, and you'll be able to see exactly how we did. But now we can take this route because I'll show you the route. I'll put the route up on the screen. There's nowhere to go around this area for any Tesla supercharging. So this route that we use all the time is now accessible to us and we don't have to make sure that we're fully charged up at home. We are at the charger and it worked for us. Thank you, ChargePoint. Make sure you subscribe for more videos on Teslas and EVs and whatever else we're doing here on the channel. Thank you so much for watching. Catch you next time. Hey, smash the like button. Thank you.